Hello again, everyone. I'm Rosart79, and I wanted to start by apologizing for not uploading in a while. I've been extremely busy with high school and all the homework and friend problems, but I've finally gotten some time to record a small video, and I didn't want to do this video on Abyssrium because I've done everything you can do, really. So I wanted to start by uh, recommending some apps that I think you guys would really like. So the first one is PewDiePie's new app, uh, Tuber Simulator. I actually really like that game right now, even though I'm in a really slow patch uh, getting to level 7. But anyway, you should check that out. It's a really awesome free game. And another one would be uh, Animation Throwdown. It has like all the best... Uh, I think they're Adult Swim shows. I think that's what channel you would find them all on. Uh, Futurama is my ultimate favorite out of the five shows, obviously. And the third one would be Mola Mola Survive. And I wanted to show you guys the stuff I had found in that game so far, since it kind of um, correlates with Ab Abyssrium. But... Um, <laughs> At first I thought to get the legendary sunfish you had to unlock all the secrets in this game, which I was really pissed off when I found out you didn't. But, you know, I kind of like the game. I haven't been playing it for that long, and I kind of stopped playing it when I ha was super busy. But, um, I guess I can show you guys the basics of it. Right now I'm on, um, non-celebrity, so... My Mola size collection so far is Sugar Ball, which is the starter, then Baby, Kid, Young Man, Non Celebrity, Mola King, and Aquarium King. So I've almost unlocked all one, two, three, four, five, six, nine of them. And I'm really excited to see which one's next. It's getting easier the more you play it, but it takes a while. And then the sudden death, there are like tons of ways you can die in this game. And, ooh, I found a new one. Um, so the first one would be Water Impact. The top ones, the top nine, are, you get them from different adventures that you unlock. The new adventures. So I've unlocked Itchy Body, Ocean Bottom Buffet, Hidden Treasure, Sunbathing, Hello Mr. Turtle, and Fish Heaven. But uh, I have yet to unlock Feathered Friends, Mola Mola Rescue, and Towards the Light. I don't really want to waste my um, points on those right now, uh, but I will eventually. And the food I've unlocked so far, uh, jellyfish, squid, shrimp, sardine, crab, and scallops. So I have two more for that. And you also get sudden deaths from eating too much of the foods and either choking on something most of the time or getting poisoned or infected but I'm not going to show you guys the food count that one's not really interesting so the sudden deaths for the adventures so far water impact for itchy body cold water that one I guess you just freeze couldn't dodge a something I think it's a rock like the mole stuck and <laughs> it's rock and dies because it's so weak um, dried up on land. Sea turtle was too scary. I remember that one because it's the most ridiculous. And eaten by humans. So I have three more to go for the uh, adventure ones. And then for the food ones, choking on a plastic bag, ate too much squid, shrimp shell, so it like scraped the inside of it and it got infected. Um, I'm not really sure. Sardine bones, crab legs, and clam shell, which it all choked on apparently and then there's some secret ones you can find like died from touching too much you just poke the mola I think like 4,000 times yeah it wasn't really worth it you don't really get a reward or anything and then the second one I found was flash which is where you take a bunch of pictures of the mola which you just go to this camera icon up here and you just keep doing that over and over until your mola dies and then you unlock more secrets to the game but so far that's all I've found um, I'm almost to 
mola king right now. And I'm on my 24th mola. So once it dies, you get a new one. And it also gives you some um, points to spend. Which is really cool if you get it to, like, a high rank and then it dies. Then you get so much more money than you would when it was little and it dies. But sometimes it's kind of hard to avoid. So I'm going to show you guys the two adventures I have right now. And then I will end this episode. And you guys should really check this game out if you like Abyssrium. Because it's... It's kind of like Abyssrium, but it's also kind of like um, any cookie clicker game, basically. Although with a weird aquarium twist, I kind of like it. And you start off with the v adventures with a 50-50 chance, and then as you keep um, succeeding in them, the survival chance goes up. And eventually it'll get to 99%, so there's a very low chance of you dying. And then if, oh, see, if I had died there when I was a younger Mola, then I wouldn't have gotten as much of a reward. And I was eaten by humans. Great. But I got 900 points to spend. That is awesome. And then you start all over again. Isn't it beautiful? I'm not going to go through this again, because I read all of that the first time. I don't need to read it again. You guys can read it yourselves. And there I am, a little sugar ball. And just eating, like, two of these things will get me up. It depends on what it is, though. So anyway, you guys should really get this game, and at least try it out. It gets kind of boring after a while, but if you're... If you stick to it, and you want to try and find all the secrets, then you will become the best Mola Mola survive player ever, which is what I am destined to become. So yeah, well, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, sorry I haven't been uploading, and hopefully I'll have some more videos eventually. Maybe I'll do some on the new PewDiePie app, I really don't know, but I will see you guys in the next video.